Hi, I'm Kasia, the product manager for Clockwork at Hero Coders. Today I'm going to show you how to make the most of the reports feature in Clockwork for valuable insights. Here's a quick overview of what we will cover today. How to view, filter and group data in the timesheet tab. How to compare time actuals and estimates. How to use reports for billing. How to view and manage your team's time using outliers and email notifications. And at the end, I will show you how to save your reports in Clockwork. Let's start with how to view, filter and group data in the timesheet tab. Here you can view data the way you want. Select the time range from a bunch of options or set up a custom one. Okay. Choose which projects you want to look at. Filter for specific epics, teams, users, versions, labels, custom fields, or work log attributes like billable time. Use breakdowns to split the data in various ways and see it from a completely different glance. You can view, for example, Epic's time split by tasks, or users and their task time. Or time spent by version by week. So as you can see, you get a huge amount of flexibility in terms of how you want to see your data using filters in the timesheet tab. Next, I'm going to show you how to compare time actuals and estimates in an EPIC or issue in Clockwork. This gives you an overview of how your projects are progressing, helps you identify bottlenecks before they become a problem, but also help you to estimate your future work even better. Great, let's keep going with how to use reports for billing. If you're responsible for billing, Clockwork is here to help you prepare the data needed to invoice your customers. Once and never do it again. All you need to do is to save your timesheet as a report and download it whenever it's needed. Okay, we're nearly done. Stick around for just another minute to see how to manage your team's time using outliers and email notifications. Use outliers to, to filter team members that match certain criteria. For example, users with more than two hours under time. If you want to ask your team to make some corrections on their timesheet, you can email them directly from Clockwork with a short note of what needs to be corrected. Finally, here's how to look at your reports. All your saved reports can be found in the Reports tab and opened also from the timesheet view in just seconds. So just a quickly recap of what we've covered today. How to view, filter and group data in the timesheet tab. How to compare time actuals versus estimates. How to use reports for billing how to view and manage your team's time uh, using outliers and email notifications, and how to save your clockwork reports. I hope you enjoyed this video. Thanks for today and see you soon.